Hello and welcome back to another Let's Play Pokemon Altair episode. Last time we beat the space shuttle hooligans that are trying to take part in taking the fuel of a space shuttle. Correct? An original emerald here. They could be stealing all of their their precious resources to go into space, such as space food. But for today, we're gonna battle this couple guarding a rare candy, which they have an electrode and a million eye birds as their line of defense. No matter, as Milo can go for energy ball, that, that's, that's not that great actually. How am I outspeeding electrode? Are you kidding? Unless it's mirror coding, I'm in for a world of hurt. Don't you dare. Okay, it missed. I don't know. Okay, let's just energy ball because I don't want to get static. And thunderbolts on the Firebird Phoenix man. It is a man. Okay, but no Tans evolution. Hands forth into battle, and I'm going to literally send and and bite. I don't know. Might as well be preservative, as that does kill. Oh, that's right. It's not bite. It's crunch. We got crunch last episode on McClaus, McClover, Mick. Cleaver. Okay, now, what are we gonna do? What I have planned for today is... I'm going the wrong way. Go over here to Sutopolis, but let's first battle everyone around here. Hello, young sir. Hi. Now, this guy originally has a Gyarados, and he still has a Gyarados. Okay, well, Energy Ball ought to be a two-hit kill. Fine by me. Set up your reign as Energy Ball destroys thyself. Okay. Now, if I'm not mistaken, there is nothing around these parts. Like, all the trainers were removed for some reason? Oh, don't ask me why. Um. Yeah, it doesn't look like they're still here. So, we're gonna take a dive underwater. Now, you may have noticed, I got the evolution of Lapras with me from the last episode, it will become our HM sleeve because I check off screen and it learns everything. It's got Rock Smash, it's got Dive, it's got, it can learn Surf. And it also can learn Strings as well as obviously Surf. I'm hoping Waterfall, I mean Lapras gets it. So we'll just go on that mentality that the baby can also learn it too. So explore a bit underwater. Now, the things in the wild here, it just includes Slowpoke from all I can tell. I haven't seen, like, the equivalent of a Relicanth in these parts. I could try sending a Repel, assuming it still works on that mechanic. Yeah, Slowpokes. As well as, like, the other variants of Chimek... Chimeko? Chinchow here! Jeez, Chimeko, wow, am I crazy? Let's keep looking around here Because as I originally stated Relicanths aren't in the Pokédex of this game So it's been replaced with something else. I don't know. Would something please appear? Oh geez finally that took a while. Hello. That was totally worth it Well, at least I'll get some EXP. Hopefully grow level. No, okay, whatever. Go to Sutopolis and look at all these changes to it. Look, it's like a darker color like it's very shadowy look over here I don't get what's the point of this there's nothing of value there's no teleporting spots and trust me I've walked everywhere hello uh, I, it's not a ditto okay I've never seen that but that's new hmm well I don't know just over here it's really a shortcut if you don't have surf I guess? Who does it bring surf in Sutopolis? Oh, it's very nice of Game Freak to not let you surf here. You know, it's nice of Altair letting you to walk over here. That girl gives you berries. This contest berries not worth it. She gives you two, though, so that's nice. Now, uh, only thing of importance in Sutopolis for now is the Brick Break to you. And this guy has a Dusclops now. That's a nice touch, Altair, guys. It's like, instead of Cackling, it's got a Dusclops. Gotta learn this Brick Break as well. If you didn't know, so we'll see Mount, Mount Origin, <laughs> Cave of Origin, later. We should go heal. Let's see what's in the wild in a bit. Okay, don't worry. And this guy right here teaches you either explosion or double edge or nothing. Oh, pff. 
Okay, maybe I'm thinking of something else. I think that's Pacific Log. Hmm, I'm hoping someone learns Explosion. That'd be nice. I'll check it out. Oh, we even see what's in the top Oh, whatever. We'll have another chance. Okay. Okay, moving on. We're gonna battle Trainers. Oh, goody. There's one down here. Hello. I wanted to battle her before going into the Sutopolis, but alas, we got to see Sutopolis first. Level 36. Holy jeez. Oh, it's still a tentacle, so. Level 48. That's great. And, yeah. No, I think this chick has a Staryu. She must have had a Goldeen. I don't know. Hmm. Must have been a Goldeen, though. Because it's Seeking and all. Oh, well. Um. Not sure if we should take on the, you know, quote-unquote Aqua base, but now it's Team Black Hole's base. Uh-huh. Well, I might go to Pacific Log, or we might just battle everyone in sight. I think that sounds better. Might as well. I do feel vastly under-leveled, because I want to get to, like, level 50. Whoa, hello. Um, really? Was this here? I feel like it's in a different spot. I don't know. Let's we'll just battle everyone. It's totally worth it. Okay, maybe it isn't worth battling everyone here. It just depends if there's anything new. Look, look at this. Tentacle, level 38. I mean, come on. Altair dudes. Okay, there's something new. Good. Thanks. Oh well, it's still level 39. I mean, compared to the gym, it was like level 52, correct? You can't see me. You're not even facing the water, like, close enough to the water to fish. Dude, get with the times, man. Level 49. I have no idea what's coming out, so let's go my clover to stand out something else. Oh, you're about to go level. Oh, a tentacle. Krell! There's like a million tentacles above Sunny Shore, by the way. I just beat Platinum for like a million time. I got so many special defense EVs over there, it was unhilarious. One more dude. Okay, you know, I said I was gonna leave, but ooh, these fishermen are tempting. Fifteen. This is quick attack. Okay. Whew. I keep forgetting. See, I need to change that around. Actually, I'm gonna do it right now. Gyarados. Oh no, no. And okay. Hopefully that didn't switch anything around. Jeez. Okay. Thunderbolt. And lastly, my low tick. No, oh, that would have been cool. Oh well. So there we go. And now, let's just move on, I suppose. Get to Pacific Lock. Uh, no, again, I'm gonna set up a repel, actually. I don't think I need to train. If I do, I'll just do it off screen. There are a couple of trainer rematches I've been meaning to show off because they got to level like 60. Is it here? Yeah, yeah, it is. Okay. So they got to level 60. This is what I want, hard skill. And they do get way higher, like to the left and right of Mauville. You can get so much EXP this early. I mean, hmm. You might not want to battle the breeders because you're going to be wasting maybe even items if you really have to. Uh, luckily, like whenever I had to grind off the screen, which hasn't been lately, but I did have to battle like level 70 things. Hello, this is... No, this is Team White Hole. Hello, we just battled them. Okay. Rock Bug Guy. Is this enough to kill? And do you have Earthquake? Ugh, what on earth was that? Barrage? No, it's super effective. Ground something. Huh. <laughs> Looked like it flung an iron ball. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, McClover, you could have taken that a bit better. Why was Crunch not very effective on it? Is it Steel Bug? It must be Steel Bug then. Okay, never mind me saying it's Bug Rock. Okay, I guess that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, hey, hey, hey. Okay, here's that other evolution of the Pony Guy. I wish it was a Pony Flying one. But it's Psychic Steel. Yeah, it doesn't look steel, but trust me, it's steel. And what do I do? Go Bernie, I can take anything. It can lash out. Even Heal Vel? Okay. Well, flamethrower. If I'm not mistaken, they're pretty fast, although Bernia outsped it, so take my word for it. Level 50. Bernia. Special attack one by. F special defense. One by four. Man, I wish I could go to Sunny Shore right now. So, McClover McClaus. Well, I don't even know what's in the wild, actually. Let's go kerfuffle for a bit. Okay, um, if I'm not mistaken, this whole area is the same. 
So, I never go this way. Like, that's something I've always realized. Like, I never bother going that way. I always just keep going up. So, we'll just keep going. Yeah. What was that? I, huh? Oh, I guess Repel ran out. <laughs> like, I don't know. Like, you can't go back. That's what I thought it said. Like, you can't go back. I was like, oh, man. Oh, well. Again, I never go to the left area. I don't remember what's over there, but I always go this way. It's just a habit. Like, you just gotta go this way. See what's in the wild, by the way. What was that? I'm trying to find what's in the wild. Sorry, Elisa. Gee, it's just water. Don't go all in the forum here. Whoa, level 6. is totally, utterly worth it. That's Sky Uppercut, not Double Kick. I keep forgetting, as in this one time. Kerfuffle, will you please land your hits? Ugh, there. I just wanted to see Sky Uppercut's animation. Great. Oh man, no, it's this way. And then you go right here. Ta-da. Okay, see, I'm a complete file. Um, Milo, okay. Let's do it. Although, I should have put our Nicola Fury. No, number one Fury. <laughs> Ooh, the legs. Okay, level 51. Oh my, I don't have to grind. Great. This is bad. It kills my whole team if it uses, like, air cutter. Hmm. What do I do? Okay, okay, I switch out. I go to McClover. Hopefully it takes a hit, and then I can outspeed and kill off the Crobat. Milo, 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 what do we do? Let's just go for fly, I suppose. That better be fly. Okay, I mean, look, cool. There goes Fly, and you're gonna Agility. Hopefully, it's not enough to kill McClover in one shot. I hope so. Okay, something missed. Did it try to hit Milo? Way to go. That did nothing. Way to go. Bliss kill. <gasps> Way to go. Okay. We're in the clearing. Oh, you stole the shell bell, you greedy ma'am. Jeez, I forgot about that. Okay. So, rock steel guy, not like the rolly wall poly guy. Okay, more agility. Good for you. Hmm, I must have been going for a bug move on Milo, now I think about it. Ooh. Let's see. Okay, I'll try to kill our bug dark guy. And, hmm. Who wants to take a bug move? I guess Bernio, but I might be baiting in an earthquake. I mean, why would he earthquake his buddy? Come on, come on. Bernie, please don't die on me. Oh, oh, jeez. Slash, I guess? It looked like it. Jeez, I cried! <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Good. And now, what do we got? Earthquake? Don't you dare earthquake. Ugh. Oh, okay. Iron defense. Nothing to see here. And, like that last battle last episode, I could just flamethrower, take it out one hit. Oh, 52. I just noticed that. Not bad. Good. Whew. That went pretty well. Even swell. Okay, now we got the ant room. Yeah, ant room. I love it. So, I think we're gonna call it an episode here. Next time, we're gonna get Earthquake right now, though. And, uh, who wants Earthquake? Remember how I complained about how I don't have anything ground? Well, now I got Earthquake. Only... Milo and Kerfuffle? Really? Hoping Nicola Fury would learn it. Oh man, now I kind of regret giving, what, bulk up to Kerfuffle? Although, that's one thing I didn't even mention while getting Brick Break. What I could teach Brick Break to. I'm thinking Kerfuffle and take off Sky Uppercut because you know how it missed on a level 6 Zubat? Yeah, that was annoying. Nicola Fury is fine with Aura Sphere, but hmm. I guess I'll give Milo Earthquake. Maybe until way later though, like... I could take off strength. I could take it off right now after like this and give it to Lapras counter baby part. Okay. Okay. We'll decide this next time. Alright. So next time we're gonna see what's down in the chasms of the seafloor cavern. This is the best part of the song by the way. So I don't want to end. Oh it's water. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, oh shh. I'll make you sigh. Great. Oh well. No it wasn't Kyogre. Shh. Don't tell your mom. Bye.